Behind me, I actually have a crazy pond. See all those babies? See all those little... Oh, I got him. There we go, look at that. You love her so much. I'm getting him out of here. This guy is a monster. Nemo, Nemo, chill. Okay, Nemo, Nemo. What is up, Raw fam? Welcome back to the most crazy, epic channel on YouTube. I'm Franklin, and this is Raw Fishing. Behind me, I actually have a crazy pond, and I want you guys to check it out. We have a fish over here, and his name is Baby Jaws. Now, if you guys know, Baby Jaws was caught in the same spot my old bass Jaws was caught. So potentially, it could be its son. This thing is crazy, and he acts just like his dad. A couple weeks ago, we set this pond up, we put a couple baits in there, and Baby Jaws is finally eating. If you guys look around here, there is no more baits around, but if you look really closely, you see all those babies? See all those little baby fish we have in there? The pregnant mom uh, mollies that we actually put in here had babies, and then, yeah, then they got taken out by, uh, by that one right there. Hello, how you doing? I don't think she cares at all, so, on that note, we are going to put an equal competitor inside of her pond. Now, Baby Jaws is like one of the most powerful fish in all the world. So now we're going to go to the Amazon and put an Amazon crazy red tail with this beautiful baby bass. Now, you guys know I don't have to go to the Amazon to catch Amazon fish. I actually have a pond over there, and it has crazy Amazon fish from all around the world. You guys want to check them out? Let's go over there. So, of course, guys, these fish aren't... They can't be that big, right? Uh, that, that fish... <laughs> they can't be... We have a, we have a net. <laughs> I don't think this net's big enough. Let's find out. Let me take my shoes off. Here we go. All right, so the correct way to, uh, to transport some of these fish is a blankie, uh, the raw fan blankie, or a towel. Oh, this is going to be for after, okay? So we're going to need that. Once we catch the fish, we're going to wrap it up and transport it. All right, here we go. I'm going to get in. Oh, here we go. We're getting in the pond. We're getting in the pond. All right, so this is going to be very oh, very very tricky now we have a bunch of big giant fish now i'm gonna scoop one up with the net here we go oh come here come here you ready here i go oh, 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 oh. i got him i got him oh, oh my. i don't got him come on oh i got him he's mine he's mine there we go okay we got him Ooh. we got him bro there we go, look at that. He's a big one. Jeez, oh, peace. All right, I'm gonna pick him up. No, 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 chill. Chill out. No, come on. He was so sweet, did you see that? He let me pick him up. All right, let's try this guy, okay? Come on. Oh, I got him. I got one, ow! Stop it, stop it, stop it. We gotta tire him out. Just a little bit. Come on, calm down. I think I got him. I don't know how this little net works like this, but I think I got him. I think we need a bigger net, dog. You think we need a bigger net? Uh, I would like to believe so. That thing's huge. Ah! So I think we got him with the world's fun. I don't think we got him. All right, so what we're going to do, we have a pool right here. Now, we're going to scoop up the, 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 the red tail and, and put him in the pool. Easy enough, right? So, we're gonna open this up. We're gonna use the net, okay? See that? Okay, here we go. Oh, you got out. Got him. This is a, a, a captured fish. We got him. We're getting him out of here. Chill out. Okay. Because once we got him, we'll just put him in there for a second so he calms down. All right. So this is just one of my red tails. These guys from the Amazon. Come on, chill. Chill. These guys are very, very cool. Let's take this little fucker up for you. Hey, see, we just want to tire him up. 
We don't want this guy to go in there full gung-ho and uh, potentially fight Jaws, because that would be horrible. So, let's see if we can pick this guy up. I right, see? We need, to, we need him to chill out a little bit. Pretty, pretty crazy fish. I'm gonna see if I could uh, hold this guy up for you. Wow, guys, this guy is a monster. Look at him. What a crazy fish. So, what we're gonna do, we got a bunch of fishies in here, all right? And I don't think this is gonna be the only fish I bring over. This is just the first one. So, we're going to, and then I wanna wrap this guy over. This is the proper way to do it, okay? And we're gonna grab him here, grab him there. Now he's good to go. Let's walk. We could put him in this ground pond if you look right here, but um, honestly, what would happen is, is that he would eat all of our pretty cichlids and stuff. So that wouldn't that wouldn't be any good. That wouldn't be good at all. This is the pond. We're gonna put him in. All right. Now we have baby jaws there, and if she's anything related to big jaws, she'll probably want to mess with this guy. Okay. So I'm just gonna slowly but surely. So she doesn't freak, see she's already freaking out. We're just gonna slowly but surely let her feel the water, okay? I don't want her to freak out, okay? Hey, chill out, chill out. Chill out. That's my beautiful red tail catfish right there. He's got those beautiful whiskers right there. And we'll let her go. Look at her, got her right there. Now just follow her for a second because she's probably gonna do something that you probably really don't see out of an average red tail. Now she's not the biggest, Raw Fam. I have I have catfish that are a lot bigger than her, but she's a nice one. I purposely didn't feed these guys uh, over the last couple of days because I knew I was gonna transport them over here. But what a beautiful fish. I mean, just look at her. She is gorgeous. Raw Fam, what other fish do you guys wanna see put into this pond? I'm going to go get one more red tail. I'm gonna get the other big red tail and put her in here. But what other red tail do you guys wanna see? Or what other fish do you guys wanna see? You guys wanna see the platinum red tail in here? You guys wanna see a tiger shovel nose? A tiger shovel nose hybrid? Who knows raw fam? Uh, honestly, I, I have no idea, but look at her. She is beautiful just sitting on the bottom. Isn't it cool how she uses? You see those two fins right here? Okay, those are her back fins. These are her pectoral fins up there. This is her dorsal fin. These are her back pec fins. And they use those as like udders. She sits on the bottom with that. She flares them out, and when she's tired, she'll just sit there like this. They're from the Amazon, so they're used to big, big, big rivers. This girl will go to the bottom of the river. She is a catfish, and she'll put those big fins on the ground, and she'll go like this, and she'll just put her nose down, and she'll just sit there in the current and wait for something to go by, and then as soon as a little fishy goes, bah, got him, game over. So. Raw fam, what fishies do you want to see inside of this pool? I'm going to put one more red tail in here, okay? And it's probably going to be one of the bigger red tails. And uh, yeah, let's do it. All right, Raw fam. So for the most part, most of these fish have no names. For the last couple months, I haven't really been posting videos because it's just been very hard. I've been taking care of so many fish. A lot of fish have gotten donated. So I want you guys to identify these fish. I want these guys to have names and I want you guys to grow with these fish. Remember, an average red tail can get 150 pounds. We are going to grow with these animals and they all need to have their own individual names. You guys are about to see one of the biggest red tails I own. He's about to be crazy. He's about to be insane, but she could only be as insane as the name we give her. So what are we going to name this girl? She's big, she's cranky, and she's going to be pissed off coming over to a new home. So fingers crossed, we got to make sure she's good. All right, you guys ready? I need, uh, Tyler, I, uh, the camera guy, I need you to be right there with me because she's going to be hard to grab, okay? I think she's over here. This is her right here. Now, this big girl right here, she has a messed up fin. So that's easily identifiable. So whenever we see her, we're gonna say, oh, that's the one with the messed up fin. That is Nemo. Or That's a good name. I like Nemo. Nemo? Because Nemo, if in the movie, she has a messed up fin. That's the lucky fin. Lucky. All right, let's get Nemo. I, I think that's a really good name. Raw fam, I'm gonna let you guys name the other one. This is easy, this is Nemo. That's not, look straight down. Look how big that fish is. That's crazy. I think this is Nemo right here. Yeah, this is Nemo right here. She's the bad fish. 
This is her right here. Come on, Nemo. Nemo, chill out. Nemo? Yeah, so she has the bad fin. I'll show you guys what I'm talking about in a second. The innovation. Yeah, bro, she's crazy. Come on, Nemo, chill. Nemo, chill. Chill. Chill, chill. Oh, hit in the face. She doesn't know I love her so much. Chill. Nemo, chill. I mean, <laughs> she's not going that way. It's a big girl. Oh, chill, okay. Okay, let's go in here, go in here. I need her to chill out. But I'm gonna show you guys how much bigger Nemo is than the last fish. Wow. What a Nemo, chill. Nemo, Nemo, chill. Okay, Nemo, Nemo, chill. These guys can last about an hour, hour and a half out of the water, so do not worry. Um, I have a rug, this is the proper way to transport a fish. If you use a net, what's going to happen is it's going to dig into her skin, cut her up, and she's going to have sores all over her body. And once they have sores, it makes their skin accessible to a bunch of different fungi and parasites, and it's, it's not good. So this is the proper way to do it. She is definitely big, and I'm putting her here so you can see, beam out, so you can see her bad fin, okay? You see this fin? This is a normal fin right here, okay? See that? This is her main pectoral fin. It's very strong. This is the barb at the end. If you come over here, give her some, give her some water. You come over here, see how this fin is all messed up? It's beaten up. All right, see how that's messed up right there? Oh, yeah. She's had that for about two, three years, okay? This fish is about three to four years old. And uh, we're gonna properly transport this fish. I'm gonna show you how to do that. You take your raw fishing towel, they get at rawfishing.com. We're gonna place this down, okay? Then, we're gonna set Nemo on top of her. Oh, Nemo, Nemo, chill out. All right, and then we're gonna fold this back. Okay, Nemo, you're gonna have to cooperate here, baby. We're good. Okay, let's go. Baby Jaws is already right here. She's checking out her new friend, okay? Look at her, she's all excited, she's amped up. She might attack soon. That's crazy. All right, you ready? Coming out, look at her whiskers, her beautiful whiskers. I love the whiskers. Go Nemo, go Nemo, go Nemo, go Nemo, hey, hey, go Nemo. <laughs> but of course guys, Nemo has a bad fin and we all know that, so that is Nemo and it only makes sense to make their names match. So if you guys like Marlin for the other Red Tails name, Roll Fam, drop a comment, give this video a like. If we get 10,000 likes on today's video, that will be their names. If not, then guys, I don't know. I don't know, what should we name them? So Rolfam, I love you guys. The top comment of this video, the one that gets the most likes will be the name if it doesn't get 10,000 likes. Rolfam, I love you guys. And, and honestly, thank you guys so much for the support lately. We are almost at three million subscribers. So if you guys haven't already, smash the subscribe button. Join the Rolfam, we are only getting better. And guys, it's about time to feed my beautiful fish, Nemo. And Marlon Rolf and I love you guys. I think it's about time to wrap this video up. I love you all babies. You later. Peace.